everyone. It's Happy Mail Queen again. I have a small haul for you guys. Uh, some things came in from my order from Etsy and also from Amazon. So I thought I'd show you guys. Um, I'll be getting my design team package soon for August. So I thought I better um, <clears throat> get some more of these magnetic vent covers. This is from Amazon, so this is uh, my Amazon haul. So this is the brand that I get from uh, from Amazon. It's called uh, Accord Magnetic Vent Cover, and it comes in a three pack. I think the price did go up a little bit, so I'm I paid six dollars and a few cents. Um, they were at one point, you know, less than six bucks, but. Uh, <clears throat> anyway, it beats, you know, me going out and driving to Home Depot and getting these vent covers. So uh, I just prefer to do it online. So I did get a couple of these. They come in a three pack um, and they're just great for storing my new dies. Uh, and then I decided to get <clears throat> some more metallic foil board. Um, again, I, I've been getting my, um, gold foil, even also the, the silver one. I'm liking this brand right here. It's called High Gloss and, um, you get 25 sheets and they're eight and a half by 11. And I already ran out of mine because the last um, memory book that I did, I lined all of my pictures with gold foiling. And anyway, I've been using it quite a bit. So, yes, this is where I get it, just in case you want to know. And I can leave the link down in the description box below for you guys if you're interested. Uh, I'm ready. I'm getting ready to do an October daily and so I decided to get this uh, snap binder I was at uh, Hobby Lobby a few days ago and I was looking for something like this and I didn't find it and so when I looked on Amazon I found it uh, how much was it it was like I know it was less than ten dollars so um, since the price was about right I would have paid maybe less on Amazon I mean on at Hobby Lobby using a coupon but um, I wanted to get the either all black or I thought this one would be fine to use for um, you know my October daily so um, I like the size and I love using you know the three ring actually this is a two ring binder so that's even better I don't have to make too many holes so um, yeah I went ahead and got it and uh, it's a d-ring actually let's open it um, so I did also get this on Amazon and I got the um, what do you call it the three by four and four by six uh, pages so that's how they look like right here and um, that's um, so I can like do some shakers and also put some pictures in here for Halloween. So I got that one. And let me just show you how this looks like. Now this reminds me of my Heidi Swap binder that I got a long time ago. I was even tempted to use that one because I want to say it's almost the same size. But that one has a lot more rings. To it also and uh, and I don't have my punch anymore because I returned it because I didn't like that it was staining my paper and um, I thought you know this is this is perfect I like using the uh, this one and um, instead of getting another um, punch I just decided to get this so anyway that is the binder I'm going to use, and then I'll just go ahead and put these um, pockets in there, and then some of them will also be full pages. 
So um, that'll be perfect for my October daily. And then that's all I got on Amazon. Is that right? I feel like I got something else, but anyway, that's all that came in. And then um, I got some stuff from Etsy. So <clears throat> this is from one of my favorite shops, Perry Ann's Arts and Things. Um, here is the store name. And I've been buying from this, um, this store for years. And um, I got everything, and it was about $34, $8 shipping. Um, and it's because it's a little heavy. Um, every time you, you know, get paper, it's pretty heavy. So that's why. Usually my shipping is only about 5 bucks or so. Anyway, I got the Good Vibes um, crepe paper. And I'm sure um, you, you guys probably found this on at Tuesday morning because this is an older collection and initially when it came out I guess there were other papers that I was kind of a little bit more um <clears throat> excited to get so I never did get this one but I remember my friend Sophia she really liked this one because it has a lot of um it has cactus and birds and um llamas and um yeah, but anyway, I saw it and I thought, oh, you know what? That's really cute. And the price was, was pretty good. Um, and then I thought I had the ephemera for this. Oh, my goodness, you guys. <laughs> I have so many things. Um, sometimes you just think you have it. Sometimes you're not sure. And I'll do a quick flip through while I'm talking here. But anyway, turns out I have the good vibes. The one from my mind's eye. It wasn't this one. It was... Uh, ephemera from a different um, collection so yeah kind of sad about that so and now I think the ephemera is harder to find um, I think I did see it on Simon Says but then I have to pay for shipping I don't want to just get that one item so I'm kind of holding off on it but anyway it's okay there's cut aparts in here I think I can work with it and then I have some stickers that I got from Hobby Lobby that I think will kind of go along with this that have um, you know, llamas, and I think some of them were paper clips. Um, oh, this one, see? Doesn't this kind of go along with it, you guys? Um, because of the cactus. And then here's some llama uh, paper clips that maybe I can even use. And I know I have some llama. See, I can't remember if I got like the die cuts or, you know, from... Um, from Hobby Lobby. You know how they have that section where they have the envelopes and things and I could have sworn I have some more llama stuff, but anyway. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'll probably maybe pick up the ephemera eventually. Okay, so then I got this Maggie Holmes Flourish. Uh, I do have this collection. However, I think I got the 12 by 12 from scrapbook.com a long time ago and I guess I never picked up this one and I like this one because it has gold foiling in it and um, some of the papers are different and I don't know maybe they have this at uh, Joann's but I guess I never picked it up thinking I had it and then when I looked in my stash I didn't have it so I thought um, why not get it? It was a good price too. So I got that flourish. And then as far as dies, um, I got this one. I thought this was really pretty from Crafter's Companion and it's a Victorian window. I love window dies. I don't know why, but um, they're just fun to cut out and decorate. And um, this is how it looks like. It's almost the same size, but not quite. Sorry for the glare, but that's how the window looks like. It's very ornate. And then, um, oh, and then I saw this, and this is from my mind's eye, Happy Days, and I just thought it was really cute with the bike and the brads. Look at how many brads you get. And um, I don't know, I just fell in love with it, and I thought, even though I don't have the collection, I can still use it with um, other papers, so I went ahead and got it. And also for inspiration, you know, I just think it's really cute. So, um got that and then lastly I got this set of dies and this is pretty heavy 
but um, they're dairy styes and um, I don't know if you guys can find this at Tuesday morning, but I know there's a lot of dairy styes right now from Tuesday morning um, that people are hauling. I have not been able to get to my Tuesday morning. Um, I know they have a lot of crepe paper stuff right now, but um, trust me, it is dangerous for me to go there. <laughs> I was trying to take it out. But anyway, you have a heart um, die that cuts out love. Um, this <clears throat> uh, six petal flower says thanks. Um, this one says happy, happy hay. I think it's a balloon. And then the, sorry, there it is. The, um, and I'm, I'm sorry if there's a glare, the, uh, butterfly. I like it. It's a simple butterfly, but it says hello. So I thought that's really cute. And um, yeah, I just went ahead and got it. So anyway, again, I like to support this particular shop on Etsy. Because, um, you know, I do get some cute things from there. Things that sometimes I, I can't find at Tuesday morning. I check there and then sometimes she has it. So, um, so anyway, that is my haul. I hope you guys are having a nice week. And um, my kids started school yesterday, so <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, it went smoothly, actually, and then I, I had to go to work. Um, so today, hopefully, I get to do a little crafting and some laundry and some cooking, um, but that's it. I have a nice, um, a nice quiet time right now. That's why I'm doing my video, because um, the kids are at school. So I hope you guys have a lovely day. I'll talk to you later. Bye.